Hello everyone, I'm Mark Daniel Patrick. Thank you so much for checking out the channel and for joining me on here. Just before we get started, don't forget, hit that subscribe button, turn on those notifications, and you can also find me at my Patreon page. We have over 200 reaction videos that do not and will never appear on YouTube. You can find the link to join in the description below. Today I thought we'd react to another Wish Bus performance. I can't remember the last time I reacted to something done on the Wish Bus, so I'm really excited to finally get to this one today. Uh, not to mention it was heavily requested by all of Katrina's fans on, on this page time and time again, so I'm going to slowly knock off those requests one at a time. This one is near the top of the list, so we're going to get to it absolutely today. Let's go react to Katrina on the Wish Bus performing Go the Distance. I have often of a far place where a hero was welcome will be waiting for me where the crowd will cheer when they see my face in a voice keep saying this is where Yeah, 
somehow, you know, I'm just not surprised by her anymore. Like it, you, once you get to some of the things that, that she's done, her, her cover of reflection, her, her cover of, you know, her cover of never enough I mean, there, at times you just, you just expect it. You're just waiting. You're waiting for that grand finale of when she's really just going to blow the roof off the place or off the bus. I, I don't understand. I hate that they make them sit down and sing these songs. I don't get it. Time, but everyone pushes through and they sound incredible. Everyone who sits on that bus and has to perform these demanding, demanding songs somehow come through with it just fine um, when they should be standing and properly breathing and being able to get it out that way. It's incredible. <laughs> don't, don't get me started. Okay, let's go back to the beginning uh, and make some comments. I have often dreamed of a fire where a hero is welcome, we'll be waiting for it's so beautiful. It, it's, you can hear how hard she has to try to hold back because she can really, she can really let go on these on these notes, um, and really is so consciously trying to hold back and just give it a beautiful, simplistic opening. And she succeeds. She does it really well. How she just swoops onto that welcome, and it's just so trademark sort of Katrina now, uh, and sounds so perfect. I mean, how many years ago is this? I, I think it's maybe six, I, I believe. Well, like 2017, uh, three, so about six years. Yeah, that's incredible. Like, she's changed so much from then till now. Um, but it's still, it, if you were to close your eyes and listen, you can still get that Katrina in her. You still know it's her. I will say one thing just before she continues here. Look, the the um, from then till now, the resonance is a little bit better for me. I hear it here. I don't know if it, maybe she's just a, a little bit under the weather performing this number, but you can hear that resonance is lacking here, and her voice just not quite as mature as what you're used to hearing now in her in her recent covers. It, it, it's cool to for me anyway because so many people have seen this years and years ago. But it's so cool for me to to go back and see where not she started, but kind of a, see such an early performance and then watch the progression of where she is now the voice maturity whether she's sick here or not the voice maturity is undeniable it's, it's, she has just come really into her own um currently in her current covers not to say this isn't incredible it really is for the time but you want to be getting better every single day and she's absolutely done that her voice has matured so much for this performance it's just that resonance here i'm lacking which is kind of making the performance get a little flat for me switch up i think that the actual writing is lead me to you it's supposed to come down and she switches it up to not have to jump down there even though she can she can get in that but she switches the melody a little bit to fit her voice a little bit better Here, especially as she's singing through this chorus, 
this is really, it's in an awkward place for her right now where currently it wouldn't be. Currently her, she has her sort of her entire range, her entire voice at her disposal. Here it just sounds a little bit muffled. It's a little bit held back. Um, you can hear it's just not quite exactly where you want Katrina to be. Once she jumps up higher um, towards the end of this number, that's where she really excels and she's had that register forever. So once she gets past this, it's just a little maybe here or just a little bit of a passaggio here in the throat that it's just a little struggling. It's just one of those areas to, to flip uh, where she hasn't quite navigated through. But like I said, recently she's matured it and it sounds beautiful. So I love watching the progression again from now or from then here and until what she does now. how open and free that is when she jumps up when she gets past that little trouble area you can hear the voice opens up just swells and just vibrates just beauty is all like is the only way i can describe it um it's a very very small but to me noticeable maybe some people wouldn't really pick up on it but for me it just it's a it's a noticeable change but it just opens up once she gets up into that higher register so it's obviously where she's the most comfortable singing uh and no wonder she loves a, a loves a good key change too just to get her up into that higher register as much as she can. sitting down on a bus my god that she's able to get that all out oh i love those there are certain people who you know those those big beautiful belting notes some people have got it and some people just don't and katrina has got you got it to spare she really does you know it, it reminds you of like a mariah carey or reminds you of like a celine dion when they hit a note and they want to hold it forever they can hold it forever it just, it never wavers. It sounds so crystal clean the entire time. And it's just, it's so impressive. There's very few people I find that can do it, that it doesn't get whiny. It doesn't get screechy. It doesn't get like, it doesn't sound like it's yelling. It all, it just sounds like a perfectly, uh, beautifully trained vocal that, uh, that for whatever reason, they were just blessed with, with these, with these skills. And like I've said the entire video, this is kind of why I don't mind finding singers a little bit later or a little bit, you know, after they've already had their their big breakout fame and then they have a huge following because now I have so many people in the comments here who can educate me on her career, on her life, educate me on the wish bus, uh, educate me on, on what they think about her voice and how it's progressed and how it's gotten even better, gotten even better from, from here uh, and to how it is now. I kind of love being able to, you know, see, almost see into the future, but it's really not of seeing her here in 2017. And I already know how incredible she's going to be and where, she, where her career is going to go and how big she's going to get. It's just, it's kind of fun to, you know, to not have to wait and anticipate where an artist is going to end up or how big they're going to be. You kind of get to go back, see where they started and now enjoy the fact that she is my God, you know, I, I talk about it all the time that I have three three female singers that I absolutely love. Adele, Jesse J, Celine Dion. Those are my three that I just always come back to that I could listen to forever, that I feel just have something a little bit extra than than anyone else. 
man i don't know i have to listen to a lot more covers of her but I, she is really breaking into that for me I, i'm afraid i'm gonna have to start calling it my top four because she's getting there for me every single time i watch her perform it's just it's just so incredible all right that's all the time we have for this video thank you so much for watching don't forget leave me your comments of what you thought of this video and what you'd like to see in the future hit that subscribe button turn on those notifications join me at my patreon page and i'm mark daniel patrick and we'll see you next time Oh,